For more than a week, mass protests are being held in more than 80 towns and cities across the 31 provinces of Iran over the death of a 22-year-old Kurdish woman called Mahasa Amini, who died shortly after she was arrested by the hated morality police of the theocratic regime in Iran. At least 41 people, including members of the security forces, were so far killed in clashes between protesters and anti-riot police and militia in escalating street violence, which may rapidly assume the dimensions of a social uprising. In a latest incident, a sister is seen cutting off her hair over brother's grief. The man identified as Javed Hayadari allegedly died in the crackdown on the protest ongoing in Iran over Mahsa Amni. As a woman identified as Javed Hayadari's sister, cuts off her hair over his grave. Grieving women can be seen throwing flowers onto the grave. A group of women in mourning are gathered behind her as she places the hair atop the flower-draped grave. Iranian women are trying to show their grief and anger, according to journalist and activist Masih Alinijad, by cutting their hair. Mahasa Amini was arrested on September 13 as she was leaving a Tehran metro station with her brother and other relatives. She was arrested along with other women whose clothes did not comply with state regulations and taken away in a morality police van. Mahasa was in a coma for three days, then died of natural causes as the authorities claim. But according to activists, the cause of her death was a fatal blow to the head. Women in Iran are even more repressed as they must obey a strict dress code or risk being arrested and ill-treated by the morality police known as Gashte Irshad, which means Islamic Guidance Patrol. The regulations mandate that women cover their hair usually with a headscarf known as a hijab and wear clothing that is a loose fitting and does not expose their chest. To enter some mosque, women are required to wear chadars, a large piece of cloth that leaves only the face or the eyes visible. Once more, following the death of Mahasa, women in Iran are at the forefront of the current protest. News desk, Kaumudi Global.